So what I might do is after I've got this going, I'll go and get this and kick the gloves, okay? Or the end of what I do in my hand, isn't it? Don't get the tip too close to it. Pretty hot, uh -huh. <laughs> It's the hottest cut flame you can actually generate with a torch. That's what I use the gas gun. Yeah, medium, not so severe on it. So some of you can keep on going. Start to get where I want it. Try not to get the end too hot. You see I'm not actually playing on the end very much. I'm playing more in the middle. You know, heat rises. Get close to where I want it to be now. You don't want to touch it, but it rises against it severely. <laughs> yep. I just had to turn it on the side a little bit. Now, where's your water trough, Danny? Danny? Now, I'm just going to put it in there, like that. And it's all got a bit cloudy, it's just the oil on it. Just let it sit in there for a little bit. Don't um, put your hand in too quick. And if I was to get that in a vice, I could snap it. Easy, really easy. Okay? So, what I'm going to do now, I'm just going to go and nip out. The edge because it is very sharp and it will cut you. Now we've done hardening, this is called tempering. And without this, if we left this over the weekend, we'd probably come back on Monday and it could be all splintered and cracked up. You just turn off here, okay, clockwise, okay. And you just turn the valves on and let the air out, oxygen and acetylene out. So your third turn lines, I'll show you. Right, so I want a bit of gas today. This is, when you're doing a tempering, you're just a very slow flame. Very easy flame. See my fingerprint? Yep. You all around it? How the hell did that happen? Possibly, uh, Andy yeah, Andy picked him up. <laughs> <laughs> you notice how far I'm holding the torch? I'm not going to put a lot of heat into it really quickly. And just there go. running it over it all around the surface, not on one side at all times, otherwise it'll bend. Oh, we need to get the oven sorted, eh? So yeah, we do. All in there. Now you can see the underside of that, you just get a little bit more heat in that area just to generalise it up. It's getting quite nice. I'll just put it in. Yeah. That stops the process. And then back in there just to totally finish it off. And to turn it off, what we do is just get the acetylene torch. Off and off. And to turn the whole plant off. Yeah. So it's always red first whether it's on or off. Yep, it blows it out. And then you just turn, you can see the pressure's dropping. You're just clean, you're killing the lines with the, with, with the fuel.